<laughs> hey everybody, it is Margaret and welcome to my channel, Texas Gal Treasures. And in this video, I'm gonna share some custom pop sockets that I got. Um, if you are on Merch by Amazon and you are able to create custom pop sockets, then this is what they're gonna look like. Or if you are interested in getting a custom pop socket, it's something that I can create for you. I um, have a video sharing how I make my pop sockets and then also if you are just interested, just contact me via email, texasgaltreasures at gmail.com or send me a message on Facebook, Texas Gal Treasures, um, and we can work out. I've done a, a few custom pop sockets for people with their logos. They turned out really nice. And let me show you a couple of the um, other ones that I did. Of course, the cat's going to go, yes, meow. So here's a couple that I did. I did one of my dad's, um, meow, goodness. One of my dad in his Navy um, uniform, one a total cat shaming with my cat drinking out of the toilet. There's one of you know my one of my guys when he was a baby. You know, so you can do custom pop sockets like that, or you can do your logo or anything you know for fun, whatever. Um, so lots of different ideas. So anyway, I got my two pop sockets here. One of them my son designed, and one of them is is me, and it's a goofy one. So we'll start with how they arrived. So this is how they arrived, like so on these little cards, and I've never used a pop socket on my phone. I see all the kids use them on these days. So this is the one, one of the ones I did, that's me. And then I did this, my, my son did this one, it says kitty kitty meow meow with a cat. <laughs> anyway, so there's those. So they arrived like all flat, like so. Hey Stacy in the chat, where's Stacy? hello. So they look like this and they pop out. So you've got like this handle thing. If you've never seen a pop socket and you're like, what in the world? So this is it. Let's see if I can pop. You know what? This is my son. I'm going to step back to the side. Let's do the one with me on it. Um, why not? So I'm taking it off here. And Pancake is going to just, he just decided he's going to meow meow. So it looks like so. And you can have it out like that. Or you can drop it. You can collapse it down and make it flat on your phone if you're like, I don't want this thing poking out all the time. So, I'm gonna peel the backing off. We'll see how it goes. Good heavens, what? He was not doing this until I started. Okay, so I've peeled the backing off. Now it says that you can stick it and restick it like a hundred times, but to not leave it off for an hour, you know, or it'll lose the stickiness. So I want to make sure I get it on my phone the right way, facing upwards, right? So that's my, my sister-in-law painted that. She did this on Redbubble. Yay. So you're my, I'm going to go right in the middle of St. Alley on its wing. I don't know if that's too low or too high or what, but that's where it's going for now. So there I am, and I can pop it out like so. And then, like, it helps if you're, like, holding your phone. So my hand doesn't cramp up like this, and then I look like a witch, like, like that all the time. Um, let's see. Does Amazon print them every time someone orders? Yeah, they print this print on demand, just like the shirt. So as soon as somebody orders it, boom. Oh look, I can put it on whichever way. Look, it twists. Ha ha. It was okay. Kitties are like toddlers, totally. Okay, so there's that. Now it can be used as a stand, like if you're standing it up watching something. Of course, I didn't have a flat surface. Look how prepared I am. I'll use my hand. So you could stand it like so, like on the table if you're watching. And then another thing that I saw is that you can get like a clip that goes in your car for, let's say you're doing navigation because I have to use my navigation all the time in this new city that I'm in. Um, so there's like a little clip that you can clip onto the air conditioner thing, um, vent, and then it like hooks in there. So it like, it's up higher, so I don't have to look down to find my the, the navigation on my phone. Hey guys in the chat. So, so far, so good. I need to get a different one because that's gonna be silly having me on there, but it was just one I made, just goofing around. But if you're interested <laughs> and you wanna get a pop socket, um, contact me and I can get it set up for you. And it's, you order through Amazon, so it's all, it's Amazon, right? Um, so there's that, cool. And then the one my son did, is here kitty kitty meow meow and they turn out like that and they're awesome so far so good so we'll see how i like it i mean it's not super intrusive on the back i can just pop it out and look there 
just hold my phone or rest it up like this. So we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Cool? Cool? Okay. Um, yeah, that's it's a quickie today, but I just wanted to come on and show you the little pops that I got. Um, if you're interested, again, if you're interested in getting one made, I can do that. It can't be something that's trademarked or like, for example, when I did my dad on his, um, in his uniform, his military, like you can see there's no military insignia showing because I can't really do that. He's, he's got another picture of himself in the Navy where he's got like the Playboy money, like 60s <laughs> on his uh, arm, you know? And so like, I don't think I can do that either because that's trademark. So yeah, so there's that. Um, can you only make them on March? So far, that's the only place. Yeah, these are on Amazon. So not everybody that's doing the print on demand has um, been able to start creating these yet. Um, but they are starting to add more and more people. So it is on Amazon. Yeah. Ta -da. Uh, and I have a few different ones that I've made. Anyway. So let me know if you're interested or if you are creating them, then I'll link the video for how I make mine. I've been using Make Merch um, because I, I create a lot of my shirts that way. My boys have been, as I, as I said, my, my sons have been playing with them. They're kind of fun because it's a little like you have this one little space to fill in, you know, so it's not this huge, you know, not like a shirt is a huge deal, but it's, it's kind of fun, like figuring out what can I put in this little circle that's cute, you know, that'll be cute. So anyway, it's been, it's been enjoyable. Like I did one that's like a kiwi, like a slice of a kiwi right there, right? You never know what people are going to want. Okay. If you have any questions or comments or anything like that, uh, leave a comment down below. Or if, if you have ideas for like, oh, I know what I could put on a circle. Let's put a peace sign or something. It could be something as simple as that. Anyway, all right, guys. I'll talk to you soon and have a really great evening. Bye, everybody.